What's up, it's your boy Rob, the Aftershock, and this is my The Advantage, uh, The Advantages of Pro Wrestling Without Fans. And if you were tagged to this on social media, you reacted to it. I want to first start by saying this video. I've heard several people say that they can't watch wrestling because there's no fans. And if you say that, and especially if you're a fan and saying that, then you know, you don't deserve to be a fan because if you can't sit and watch a, a show without fans or other fans, then you shouldn't be a fan. You need to go find something else to watch. And if you are a worker in this business and you say, well, you know, why do shows when there's nobody going to be there? You know, <laughs> that's a disrespect to this business. And, I mean, they teach us something. Whether it's one, one hundred, one thousand, one hundred thousand, you you entertain the same way, you wrestle the same way, you work the same way, and for people that's in this business is saying, well, we're not going to do shows. Well, and I'm strictly talking mainstream wrestling. I'm not talking about indie scene. I'm talking about mainstream WWE, TNA, or TNA, uh, AEW. If you if you're if you're not going to sit there and watch the show that they're putting on, they're putting on a show. They don't have to, but they're putting on the show. And if you are going to sit there and be saying shit like that, then you're just disrespecting this business, in my opinion. And if you don't agree with that, I'm sorry. Um, as far as mainstream wrestling goes, we have forgotten that referees and managers are also part of the show. You can have two people working in the ring, wrestling in the ring. You can have a manager or a manager for both sides and a referee. That's five people in the sh doing a show. And in mainstream professional wrestling, we forget about those uh, managers and referees. And I'll give you a good example. I mean, you watch these SmackDowns, Raws, um... WrestleMania and pay-per-views and AEW, and you can hear the managers talking to the to the to the wrestler that they're in, they're supporting, and then you hear the referees, you know, have a genuine emotional interest in what they're doing, and as fans, we forget that sometimes. I mean, you see it all the time on independent shows because most independent shows. 99% of independent shows still had that emotional connection that you see from the fans, from the point of the fans, that you have referees and managers that much deeply involved in the match as it's happening, not just the people wrestling. So, that's my thing. And if you have an independent show who's actually putting shows together and have uh, being put on Facebook or Twitter, whatever, some type of shared media. I mean, and you just don't watch it. I mean, that's a, you don't need to be a fan if you can't appreciate it. And if you're in the business, you don't need, you're disrespecting the business by looking at it and saying, well, we're not going to look at it because there's no fans. And, and it's, it's something that's really got me heated because, I, like I said, I've, I've heard and I've seen people on, on social media say they're not going to watch wrestling because there's no fans. What the hell? It's the same art. It's the same format that you've been watching for years. What's the damn difference if there's a fan or not? If you're a fan, and like I said, if you're in the business and you say some shit like that, that's a disrespect to the business. You know, so, you know, kind of think about that, especially if you're in the business, you know. And if you're a fan and, you know, you're like, well, I'm not going to watch this because it's just not as good. You know, screw you. You're not a real fan of the business or a fan of professional wrestling. And you don't even need to be in the business if you're in the business talking some shit like that because it just don't make no sense. It really don't. But that was my advantages of wrestling without fans in the arena. I hope you liked the video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. Leave some comments below. And you guys have a good day.